Hi there, this is Adam Lane from Pocketnow.com and we're here at the Nokia Lumia 1020 event. So let's check it out and uh, we'll see how it works. So I have the um, Nokia Pro camera, and you can see the um, different settings that you can manually adjust. So you swipe the little camera icon. Yeah, or you can um, go to each of these separately. The thing is that the normal point of shows camera in this kind of situation, let's say you're at a party, and there's a nice band playing, and you really want to capture the moment. Yep. You take a photo, and what happens is that, you know, some of the faces are really pitch black. Yeah, Stay in the shade. Back right here. Yeah. So what you can do with this, you can change manually the exposure value. Something like this. Or if you don't like the band, you want to see the background, just do the opposite. Yeah. Do you have any high dynamic range options where you can... Actually, I had the uh, flash on, so it kind of changes the dynamics a bit. Sorry, could you repeat the question? HDR options, high dynamic range? Uh, no, no, no. no. And if, if you want to have a um, more in-depth discussion on the um, camera technology, you should talk to our engineers. Okay. Now, does this, is this the default camera app when you yeah, press this the, is the camera button? So I can show you how it works. So if I press the camera shutter, and it, goes, it automatically opens the pro camera. And then you press it, you can see the previous photo. And what, what's really cool about this is the manual focus. Yep. So if you want, we can have a look over there okay. with the leads. So gotcha. if you step over there, I can... Uh, obviously the problem is that when you try to focus using the... Uh, just tapping the screen, yeah. it will focus on the leaves. What if I want to take a photo of my colleague at the background? So what I can actually do is um, launch the uh, manual focus. Because if I... So we'll now focus on the leaves and then gradually on the background. But it still does uh, tap to focus for auto-focusing, right? Yeah. So if I don't want to use manual Turn focus, back auto. I could just... Uh, this. Okay. And obviously, the benefit of all these controls is that you can really unleash your creativity yeah. and do a lot of funky stuff that is not possible on a normal smartphone yeah. camera. How about, um, can you do high-speed shutter? Yeah, or sure. So is, the, is there a panoramic mode built into this? Because I know you have a separate app for panoramas. Oh normally. yeah, it's, yeah, it's not built into this. It's this not one. built into the... So there's, uh, it's on this uh, smart camera. Okay. So this is the um, shutter speed, up to 4 seconds. And um, down to 1 is 16,000. I mean, can you do like 5 frames per second? No, m uh, no. multiple shutters. So that would be on, um, on the smart camera. Okay, a different app. Yeah. So you have to switch. Do you have that installed? Are you able to change the default uh, camera lens? Yeah, you are. Is that in the, one of the like in the settings somewhere? Uh, yeah, actually. Um, so I could choose smart. Um, Yeah, actually, pictures. Yeah, here we go. Photos and camera. There I am. 
and okay cool so you can choose the default so, yeah. so this would be the built-in app yeah it still gives you the uh, 5 megapixel the regular yes. microsoft one yeah and then you oh, over sampled pixels okay. then nokia smart cam and nokia, uh, nokia pro cam okay so smart cam you can set for default if you want to yeah. do high speed shutter or what else does smart cam do What are the options here? Yeah, so, um, it's actually pretty cool, so let me show you. Just Probably that lower right button. Yeah, that's right, so you have oh, a. That's the lens. Actually, no, sorry. Um, that's a action shot. And then, table settings. Okay, there's best shot. Now, yeah, oh, there's so, your options. Yeah, best shot. So there, yeah. Um, motion focus. It's quite cool, actually, as well. Okay. Um, what are the other options? You can change faces, remove moving objects. But the panorama is not built into this one, is it? Actually, uh, the panorama is a separate app. Another separate app. All right, thank you. So, here's a look at the internal. I have the perfect length of arms. Here we have the lens structure. So this is the camera grip. Yep, so today we're here at the Lumia 1020 launch event. So what I'm showing you right now is the camera grip to really enhance your stability of holding the phone. So now um, this camera grip also comes with an internal battery in it. It has 10, 20 milliamp first power in there. So you can just literally slide that in. There is a USB cable here, as you can see. Slide that in snap right in. It has the mechanical physical key so it's really giving you the yeah. feeling of taking a photo. So I can just long press it and it can bring up the Nokia Pro camera as your default camera. So now you can see that there are people outside in the, looking out in the New York yeah. skyline. So you can see the grip here and then there's battery charging and you can also turn on the battery light to just see how much battery you still have in, nice. the, in the camera grip and it has a really ergonomic design so you can hold it and have a very 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 steady uh, grip to it. And so at the that same adds a little bit of length over here. Yeah, it does. It has a little bit of thickness over how here much as well. It is here. Uh, you can have a feel. There you go. Yeah. And one cool thing about it is also have a universal um, standard screw. So you can screw it to your tripods that you already tripod. have. Uh, tripod yeah. mount or any excellent any equipment that you have. And this is an extra $79. This is seventy nine dollars. Uh, U dollars, correct? All right. So how do you take it out? You just pull so the phone. So take it out. Um, yeah, you have to kind of basically snap off both sides. You can use the left right to slap next. Snap, snap off the front. Yeah. Yes. Well, because I mean, we're trying to make it a little bit tighter, so you can, and then you just slide out again. So you can just and there's a. There's contacts on the inside. Yeah, so this oh, is there's the a USB, USB port. Yeah. And then over here you have the wireless charging. And over here it also comes with the wireless charging as well too. So I already have it snapped on. So you just have to put on a cover. It enables a uh, Qi wireless charging. It comes with the cover, or it the does cover not. So it's custom. yeah. But I just already put that on. Uh -huh. I don't know. I should take it off. How much thicker does this make it? I don't know that information. Uh, well, let's just look. Yeah. And normally the phone is, what was the thickness again? Yeah, the thickness is 10.4 millimeter. 